So here's the test outline for Thursday's test. Again, this is not tomorrow. This is for Thursday. Um, one, one with calculator problem, but it's like one setup, one scenario where we ask four different things. Right? Like, I mean, you can probably guess the things. How high did it go? How far did it go? How long did it take to get there? And one other thing. But one scenario, type it in the calculator, and then find all the pieces. So vast majority of it is no calculator. It's marked out because this used to be a longer test, like a block day test, I think. So I mixed half of the graphs and half of the equations, and you're still getting eight of each. So there's still plenty of uh, questions there and plenty of points to be had or missed, but hopefully had. Eight multiple choice. Um, well, let's back up. Eight graphs from equations. So like I give you the equation, you do the graph. And then eight, I give you the equation. No, I give you the graph, you give me the equation. These are just like the last couple of worksheets, right? Where the, the front half is you do the graph, and the back half is you do the equation, just like that. Eight multiple choice, mostly on converting polar to rectangular points and equations. Some of them are just like what equations do you use? And so like which one is not true? And, you know, we can scramble those up. Two intersection problems like we were just doing and one graph a parametric problem where we sort of lay out the table for you and you fill in the pieces and then graph it. So I think fairly straightforward. There's definitely two separate topics on this test though, right? There's parametric, that's the projectile thing and the parametric graph, and then there's the polar stuff.